Yo, what is going on everybody? This is Samuel Brown, aka RBT, and today we're going to be testing our luck on pulling one of the two, or possibly both, of the epic 24-hour cards that were released into Ultimate Team today. 99 overall Marshawn Lynch and 99 overall Patrick Willis, both are called Boss Cards, and I'm going to try my luck today and get those two cards and open up three Legends packs. I'm not going to do the Legends bundle because I'm not rich, but... Anyways, I am going to pull three Legend Packs and maybe get lucky and pull one of them. Hopefully, at least pull a couple good Elites. And I'm not real sure when I'm uploading this video, but if you haven't seen by now, if I haven't uploaded a video with this by now, I have a new, better ghetto setup uh, with this little small table in front of me just randomly. But I got to have a way to set up my mic because the external microphone on my new webcam is just absolutely awful. And hopefully within the next week or so, I'm going to have my green screen set up behind me. So it's going to be all looking nice and professional. But anyways, let's check out these two cards first. The Marshawn Lynch Boss card, 99 overall. I believe that is the cheapest one up. Or maybe this one down here is. Okay, this one right here is the cheapest up right now. Going for a buy now of 2.599 million coins is absolutely insane. Checking out his stats. I mean, just look at that. There's just no words. Absolutely no words. Not even going to talk about it. It's absolutely insane. That gives plus 20 to long pass and ground and pound. I mean, this card is just absolutely epic. And now moving on, we have Patrick Willis at linebacker with a card that's just as equally epic as Marshawn Lynch. It's going for about the same price, if I'm not mistaken. There are two of them up right now. Actually, this one's going for a little bit more. 2.77 million coins. His stats are even crazier with 101 tackle, 101 pursuit. It's absolutely insane. It's actually his career tribute card. And, I mean, there's nothing else to say. It's an absolute epic card. Plus 20 the zone defense and pass rush. So we're going to try our luck and get one of these boss cards. Going to open up three legend packs. And let's see if I can make this video in one take. I think I'm doing pretty good so far. But as you see, 2,300 Madden points I loaded up onto the account. Let's open up this first Legends pack with old Deion Sanders on the front. Let's see what we can get. Hopefully, I won't mess up and open up one with a Madden Coins. But hey, the first card is my first Road to the Playoffs Elite that I've pulled all year. Joe Barksdale, 87 overall right tackle. I pulled a pretty good amount of Elites, but never a Road to the Playoffs Elite. So, I'm kind of happy about that. I'm not sure what he goes for. But, I mean, pretty decent stats, 87 overall, I'm not complaining. I know a lot of people would just probably go, eh, meh, but my first road to playoffs elite, I'll take it. Moving along, Jerry Hughes, we get Andy Levitri. And let's keep on going, here we get Mike Williams, here we have Lance Kendricks, and we get a Franco Harris collectible. So not the greatest first pack, no boss cards in this one, but we do at least get an elite, so it wasn't an absolute worthless pack. So let's just move right along here, open up our second out of three uh, legend packs, and maybe we can get at least another elite, maybe we can get lucky and get one of those boss cards. Here we get Charles Woodson, hey he's a legend in his own right, both these players are. Here we get Darius Hayward Bay's uh, scouting combine card that turns into a 96 overall I believe. And this is pretty interesting, but I think he's like the cheapest one out there. These cards don't usually go for too much. If I'm to guess, probably under 10k. Could be completely wrong. But Brandon Merriweather, here we get. That's the Angelo Hall collectible. I'm not sure what this one goes for, but since Legend uh, packs are out, probably not too much. But hey, it's still a decent one of the. It could have been George Blonda. Last card out of the pack is Bruce Miller. So nothing too insane out of that pack either. So here we go, our last legend pack, our last chance at one of those insane boss cards out. Probably not going to get it, but hey, there's a bunch of boss abilities out of these legend packs. Let's see what we're going to get. We get Jeremy Mincy, here we get at Steve Atwater's collectible. Uh, that should be decent. Here we get Kenny Vaccaro, Austin Howard, Leon Hall, Bruce Arians, Redskins offense, and we get Jamarca Sanford. So that's gonna do it. We didn't get anything insane whatsoever. We got one elite card out of three Legends packs at 20 something dollars. That that's not worth it. But anyways, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope you enjoyed the new setup. And like I said, green screen coming soon. I think I've done this video in one take, and that's probably like a record. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure to drop a like. And if this video is 100 likes, 
I will do some more pack of openings like this when they release some of these crazy cards that's going to be coming within the next couple months. But anyway, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. I will catch you guys next time. Have a great rest of your day. Peace.